2020 brought a record number of murders to the capital city. The Tallahassee Police Department says 27 people have been murdered this year. And as we transition into 2021, city leaders and local organizations tell ABC 27's Christian Thomas they're looking to see that number decrease significantly. When it comes to violent crime, we need to make great gains. Mayor John Daly says going into the new year, decreasing the amount of violent crime is top of mind. With an uptick in murders, especially raising a red flag, not just locally, but nationwide. We're seeing in Tallahassee, we are also seeing in other communities, and it kind of mirrors the national trend. Tallahassee on the rise from 2019 when law enforcement reported 21 murders. I know that we put our resources together, that we can influence and change the way these numbers are going up. Whitfield Leland III is the executive director of the Community Roundtable 850. He says the key is educating the community on how they can reduce crime together. Things like identifying high crime areas and building relationships between the community and law enforcement. We have opportunities to seize certain situations to change or even bridge the gap between uh, police, the police and the, 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 the communities. And I think that's where the problem stems at is because there's no relationship between the two. TPD has had three police-involved shootings in 2020, which brought about the city's Citizens Police Review Board, all making strides to turn things around in the future. Mayor Daly says another branch of this is mental health response. And we will continue to work with our law enforcement agencies, our mental health uh, partners in the community as well, so that we can help um, stem this violent crime that's taking place in our community. Forming an emergency response team that could de-escalate situations. Community leaders say results may not be immediate, but if everyone works together, 2021 can move this trend in the opposite direction. It's not going to happen overnight. You know what I'm saying? We got to continue to fight, continue to push. You know? In Tallahassee, Christian Thomas, ABC 27. And the city is still accepting applications for the Citizens Police Review Board, and that deadline has been extended to Tuesday, January 5th.